The material gathering and engineering journey that is part and parcel of the Elite Dangerous Odyssey on foot experience can seem completely overwhelming to anyone not intimately familiar with it. If you've been struggling to find your way with it then fear not. In this video I'll break down how to use the ED Odyssey Material Helper app which is in my opinion a must have companion for Odyssey's engineering. To make sure you don't miss any of our videos hit like and subscribe and remember to click the little bell icon and select all notifications and if you'd like to help directly support this channel you can also join our Patreon via the link in the video description. At its core the Odyssey Material Helper app allows you to create multiple wishlists of tasks that you'd like to achieve in Odyssey. Once you've added that task to a wishlist the application then lists the materials you need to gather in order to achieve that task. Because the application is able to read the journal files that are created by the game as you play it can tell when you pick up a material or unlock an engineer etc and changes your wishlist requirements real time as you play. Similarly if you pick up a material that has no intrinsic value in the game the material helper will again warn you in real time allowing you to immediately drop that material thus saving precious bag space. To get started make sure Odyssey is selected on the far left of the screen and then go to the wishlist tab. Along the top of the wishlist tab you should see an options drop down menu. Click this and select create wishlist. In the dialog box that appears type in a name for your wishlist that has meaning to you. Next navigate to the loadout editor tab immediately below the wishlist tab. Here you can create an entire loadout featuring a suit and appropriate weapons plus upgrades and engineering mods ready to be added to your wishlist. Click options again at the top and create yourself a new loadout giving it a name that works for you. Next add whatever suits and weapons you need for your loadout via the two menus at the top. For this demonstration I'm going to create a basic Maverick suit sniper build that would include upgrades for both suit and weapon from grade 1 to grade 5 and add 4 engineered modifications to each piece of equipment. Once you've created the loadout be sure to navigate to the bottom of each piece of equipment and add that build to the wishlist you created earlier by clicking add to wishlist. Ensure that you do this for all the equipment in your build, suits and weapons. Once you've added everything from your loadout editor you will see all the required materials for all of the upgrades and mods in the wishlist tab. If you mouse over any of the blueprints you've selected the application will highlight just the materials needed for that blueprint and mute everything else. And if you mouse over any of the materials the application will show useful information detailing where to find that material, where other players using the app are mostly finding that material and what recipes it's used in. Specking out a complete loadout and adding to your wishlist is one way to proceed but I personally found the huge list of materials needed made it challenging to see the progress I was making. Alternatively and what works for me personally is adding items to the wishlist just a couple at a time, achieving those specific goals and then adding the next level of upgrades or mods to the list and removing what I'd already achieved. You can add individual upgrades, mods or even engineer unlock tasks from the list of dropdowns on the left hand side of the screen. The overview tab will show you all the materials you own and then allow you to filter by irrelevant ones for example, allowing you to see how many you own of each. I found this tab really useful when it comes to clearing out space in my inventory as I can easily see what materials it's safe to sell or to dump. The apps creator has also populated the horizons tab with some useful information for unlocking ships engineers and engineering ship equipment but it's odyssey where the main focus for this invaluable tool currently resides. 
You'll find links in the video description below to take you to where you can download the application and you'll also find a link there to the official ED Odyssey Material Helper Discord. How have you got on with Odyssey Engineering? Are you already using the Helper app or has this guide helped you? Let us know in the comments below. That's it for now. Thanks very much for watching. If you found this video useful consider subscribing to the channel and maybe take a look at one of our other videos linked on screen right now.